A new federal infrastructure grant is going to transform downtown Burlington. City and state leaders getting together this afternoon to share the plans. NBC5's Tyler Boronsky was there and has more on what this will look like when it's all done. Tyler. Yep, right now, well, Burlington getting one of the largest federal grants the city has ever seen. And city leaders say the changes are going to greatly improve the downtown. More than $22 million revitalizing Burlington's streets and public spaces. This federal grant improving this section from South Winooski Avenue to Cherry Street. Reconnecting this neighborhood from north to south, creating great new outdoor public spaces and improving public transportation and creating the public infrastructure that supports new housing and economic opportunities in this vital part of the downtown. Those federal dollars gives the city nearly $50 million total to invest in the downtown. It includes about $16 million in TIF funds, along with $12 million in federal funds secured by Senator Patrick Leahy. As hard as that work is and as happy as all of us are that we had success with this money that's coming to do real things in Burlington, the hard work is right here. That hard work will include creating better sidewalks and streets, improving public transportation, and developing more areas for more housing, while construction will impact local businesses like outdoor gear exchange on Church Street. Owner Mark Sherman says he sees the bigger picture. This, along with the completion of the city place, will continue to expand the shopping district beyond Church Street and in doing so bring more and more strength and diversity to the downtown shopping district and help support the many local businesses like ours that have and continue to invest in the community and make Burlington a great place to live and visit. Some of the money will also be used to create a new workforce development and job training program through the city. The focus is on low-income youth, youth of color to develop the skills in order to fill jobs in the higher paying construction industry. Mayor Moreau Weinberger is excited to see how they continue building the city up while limiting how much it hits people's wallets. It is pretty remarkable, I think, that we will be able to do something approaching $50 million of infrastructure investment with um, uh, that small of a fraction being um, carried by current property taxpayers. Now, construction will start at the end of 2024 and will be done in phases. Live in Burlington, Tyler Bronski, NBC5 News.